Huyo sio ule Susan alikuwa anatembea hapa kanisani peke yake kitambo. Biblia inasema he who finds a wife finds a good thing. Seneta Kehika ametembea na mtoto wa hapa GM. Amesema arudi kanisani na bibi yake tafadhali mumuone mume wa Seneta Kehika yuko hapa bwana Mboro. Newly weds. Karibu Seneta. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Na useme ni DP ndio alisimamia Asante sana mheshimiwa KJ. Your Excellency the Deputy President Mama wetu Bishop Margaret Wanjiro na kanisa yote ya Jesus is alive ministries mheshimiwa rafiki yangu Karioki na all the leadership ya kanisa na my colleagues the senators here nimesikia tuna wakili Cheriot and wakili I noticed you never bothered to correct so you are just another fraud <laughs> God is good and all the time now bishop margaret as a young girl growing up you are some of those ladies that we looked at and you really really inspired us and we wanted to become ladies like you and hopefully in our own little steps we are getting there but leo nimekuja kwa hii kanisa and i'm so inspired by your vision and i am glad to have been here and to also be part of this vision that you have put together so when i hear that or when it seems as though some people want to believe that women cannot be leaders that women cannot be at the table na shindo kama wanatembea in this country because Bishop Margaret Wanjiro, you have had a vision and you have led this church to this point. Na sasa nikiangalia these buildings, I'm just in awe. So I pray for you that the desires of your heart will be fulfilled as a church. And I say like my colleague said, hopefully in the next few months, one year or so, tutakuja kufungua. Because we shall already have done it. So I am really, really pleased and happy to be with you here today. Uh, pia niseme, as a, kwa sababu pia this is our nikazi yetu. So we have to sort of touch on what is important at this point in time. Ni hii maneno ya BBI tunasikia. By the way, as Bishop Margaret Wanjiro has said, Your Excellency... We love you very much, but we hate to tell you the truth. Ground iko tofauti. <laughs> Just so you know. <laughs> as much as we are trying to support, and as difficult as it seems to support, there is a lot of heavy lifting that needs to be done. Because at some point in time we were told that the reason for the handshake, the reason for BBI, was to bring people together and end divisive elections but now on the other hand the same people who are proclaiming that from the mountaintops sasa wanatuambia the train has left the station and they no longer have the time the desire and the need to listen to millions of kenya na tunawaambia waende pole pole they must listen to the millions of kenyans who still have maoni na wanataka kuongezea because there is no rush there is no hurry and for those who seem hell bent on pushing some camps to yes and others to no just so that they can have a political match why can't they just wait for 2022 to have that na sasa pia we are in a country where we are all nobody is nobody lives under a rock in this country we are aware our economy is in the ICU as we speak. As we speak, you have doctors going on strike on Monday. As we speak, we are seeing our frontline workers dying of corona because they have not been provided for with PPEs. Yet to Najua PPEs are also lying in the storage units in Kemsa. Na tukadanganyo hapa atisijui within 60 days COVID billionaires will have been dealt with. Na hiyo maneno ikaisha because pia sisi kama wa Kenya we do not get angry enough. We must speak up and we must not let 
this getaway. So the priority, I am shocked that the priority can be BBI at this point in time. When a minister for health is called to parliament and cannot be available in treasury because they are out there collecting signatures. Atakama niko kwa kanisa leo because I am in church, Bishop Margaret. Naona kama kuna urogi. Hii maneno ya urogi naona kama ni ukweli. Na hawa watu wetu wamerogwa. Na nataka uwaombe bishop, na tuwaombe sisi wote. Because it cannot be business as usual when Kenyans are dying of corona and the, the people who are, have the responsibility of making sure that uh, the, the hospitals are able to handle these Kenyans are out there collecting signatures of BBI. He BBI ni tutakula ama ni nini hii? What is this? And on top of that, this BBI is increasing the burden to Kenyans. Na pia, ni signatures are wongo. Let me add that. For those probably who did not hear from my colleagues. Those are fake signatures. Lakini, hopefully in time when they are published, IEBC will take a clear look and look at it. So that we can make sure that we, 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 we do away with those. So as I finish, first of all, ulikuwa una, you are making a lot of jokes on my father. Na hiyo haikuwa poa. Naona utadilipa or something so that you can name. Sasa as I finish, the women of Kenya, I don't know why it seems as though we are children of a lesser God in this country. I don't know why it seems that when they want to change things around, the low hanging fruit, ama ile vitu they can mess around with, are women. Lakini wakitaka kura, sisi wa mama, we are frontline kuwasaidia waingia kwa hizo viti. So when these BBI people sit down and decide to take out zile seats the women reps from the National Assembly where the budget of this country is discussed, where their voices can be at the table and instead they want to take them away to the Senate and then nominate over 100 women to Nasema Washindwe. The women of this country, and actually I believe the people of this country, want to be able to elect their women leaders the same way they are electing their male leaders. Is that correct? Ama munataka nominations wa mama? Munataka nominations, maybe tunawatatea buri. We want women to also be given the same chance to get elected. Sivio, so that when we go to parliament, you are able to have a voice, so that they don't do to the women what I saw them do to Senator Omanga a few months ago. When as a party, you can now make a phone call and tell her you must vote this way, because to look at kiti. We have strong women like Bishop Margaret. Now, by the way, watch a tuni niombe. Whatever seats, seat she runs for, mumu patia yo kiti, roho safi. sawa. Because we need this kind of strong women leading this country with that kind of vision so tunasema we will not agree as women and that's why we are saying the train cannot have left the station tutaangusha hiyo train huko kwa barabara tutaweka ma sijui nini tunaweza weka ili isimamisha hiyo train tutafu tutangoa really my friends but the women of kenya must be respected our space must not be interfered with and that is why we say we shall not give you a blank check to bring your relatives, your girlfriends, or whatever, at the extent of women who want to run for seats and be elected. Thank you very much. God bless you. Tuko pamoja. Thank you.